So right now I'll be showing you how to neutralize a boiler sample for conductivity because performing conductivity in a boiler, boiler sample uh, is different than taking normal conductivity. So for this you will need a 100 milliliter flask as well as the conductivity neutralizer R7022 and of course your boiler sample. So you will rinse it with RO water just to make sure there's no residual chemicals or water from the previous samples. And then you will rinse it with the boiler water and that way you know that it's uh, completely just boiler water. And then you'll fill this up to 100 milliliters. one drop and it should turn pink. Same thing. Oh, that was my one drop. I apologize. But as you can see, it turned pink. So now we will add continue adding this until it turns clear. And then swirl. Continue adding some until it turns clear. Swirling as you go or swirling as you add. So then you will take this sample, you'll take your conductivity meter, and then you'll rinse this uh, with our RO water first. And then you'll rinse it three times with this sample. And you gotta remember though that you have a finite amount of this sample that you just made. So you want to use it sparingly to ensure that you have enough to actually get your measurement. Okay, and then you will add your sample, press connectivity, then you'll read it. So we get 1577. 